Hello YouTube, in this video I kind of want to cover uh, the panel icons down here at the bottom. You know, it's it's kind of one of those things that it, it ought to be real simple to do, but if you don't know where to look or how to do it, then it can seem to be just one of those stupid little things that you just you, you just don't know how. <laughs> okay, so um, I, I felt a little bit silly, you know, once, you know, once I, I, I finally figured out how to do it. It was way simpler than I thought it would be. So I'm going to spare you that, and I'm just going to show it to you <laughs> so you don't have to feel silly about it anymore like I did. <laughs> so, okay, so if I want to add icons down here to the panel, this is a, a walk in the park. Go over here to the application launcher, find the application. So I'm going to go over to applications, and for me, uh, the two that I just installed for PAMAC, um, I want to go ahead and put them down here for easy and quick access. So all you got to do is come down here. Here's one, update software. I'm going to right click on it and then go to add to panel. And it will put it right here. It will add it to panel. You can also set up launchers and you're welcome to play around with the launchers. Um, what launchers are, are like lists, I think. Like a launcher menu kind of thing. Um, but in any case, uh, that's one. I want to do the other one. I'm also going to show you how to do the uh, fix an issue with the desktop. It's kind of a twofer in here. Um, let me go ahead and run down here. System and let me grab the other one real quick. And I'm going to do it the same way. Add to panel. Right. All you have to do is right click it and then click add to panel. And it'll stick it down here. Okay. Now, you'll notice that I have a very nice and clean desktop. This is the way I like it. But some people, you know, especially if you come from Windows, you like having icons, you know, uh, on your desktop. Things, you know, you can click and, and get to right away. I like to use the panel for that. Um the quick launch, if you will, but if, if as an example, we'll, we'll use uh, Firefox, okay? That's something you use all the time. Um, let's say I want to add this to the to the desktop. Same kind of thing. You just right-click, and then you go to Add to Desktop. All right, now I'm going to show you something a little bit odd. Um, used to be, in the old KDE, um, it, had the, it had the bar on the side that you can grab hold of it, and you can click, and you can drag it around. Um, you can do it with uh with fire or with the uh, with the icons now um but if you'll notice there's no there's no little bar over here to grab hold of well since they changed kde uh that's gone away it's it's made for a much cleaner um installation um but in order to get that bar to appear by default you can't all you have to do is click and hold on it and then let go and then the bar will appear and then down here, you can grab hold of it, and, and you can move it around. Um, it's also got the settings, you know, your icon settings in here. Um, this is to rotate it. So if, let's say, you want to, you know, rotate it, you know, 90 degrees in another direction, you can do that. Um, when you come off of it, you know, it'll disappear. And like I said, you just right-click and or left-click and hold on it again, and it'll show up. And this right here allows you to resize it, which is cool. You just click and drag. And then you can make your, your icons as big as you like or as small as you like. Um, you know, whatever. Yeah, that's that's entirely up to you. Now, like I said, I'm not a big fan. See, if I click and I drag it, it doesn't work. Now, if I click and hold, once that pops up, then I can drag it. Okay, once once the side drives uh, appears or that bar appears, then you can drag it around. Okay, now, if you want to get rid of it off your desktop, you just use this. You know, the little X, the little red X at the bottom, it'll say widget removed, and it's gone. Um, that's entirely up to you, but I figured I'd share that 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 with you, uh, because it's, it's just a dumb little thing, but, you know, it, it, the funny the funny thing is, is it's, it's a dumb little thing. It's not really hard to do, but unless you, you know how to do it, then, you know, you might run into some issues, you know, trying to get, <laughs> be able to move it around or do whatever you want to with it. And one of the great things about Arch is that you get to customize, you know, almost almost everything so with that being said hopefully this has helped you out i know it was a dumb little video but hopefully you know it's something that might help you out you know to to make your your computing experience in arch linux with kde um much much nicer so uh please come on over to bahamadawest.com visit us on uh facebook join and like and that's that's a lot of people don't know that you have to click the like button in the banner um on the facebook page in order to kind of join the community and get the status updates. So every time I put out a new video or, or sit there and just BS, it's one way that I like to try to uh, have some interaction with you guys. I'm also on, uh, I'm also on Twitter and you're welcome to come over. All those links are down below and I, I definitely encourage you to do so. It'd be great to hear what you have to say and, 
if you guys run into some issues, you know, even stupid little things like this, um, that is not stupid when you don't know how to do it, but you feel well, like I do, I felt a little silly that, you know, I was kind of fighting with it <laughs> when it really was something very, very simple. Um, and if I can help out with, with little things like that, you know, don't feel dumb because, uh, we've been there. I've been there. I still run across stuff. <laughs> it's like, well, how do you do this? And it turns out to be something super, super easy. Um, and uh, of course, you know, if, if, if you, you're running into that same, it, the same scenario I was in before, then absolutely I'll help you out. <laughs> so, and, and not, not be judgmental about it. Cause I've been there myself anyway. So with that, thanks a lot for watching and, and definitely stay tuned for future videos.